how are you guys? I'm so enjoying in Chennai. It's very nice, but it's very sweaty and hot. But still, it's my Chennai. It's my place. It's my hometown. It's you get lot of positive vibration from Chennai. You know, you have to come here to see, to believe it, and to feel it. It is such a wonderful place, and the people with lots of diversity and with the people, it reflects the people's mindset. You see, it is such a positive place. I'm enjoying so much, but little bit of guilty feeling that my kids are not here. I'm missing. them i'm missing my hubby too i miss you guys we have got a huge mango tree in our house i'll show you all the trees that we have got it has got lots of raw mangoes but we couldn't pick it it is so high up there but my mother in law picked some of them because i love mangoes so she got someone come here and pick them all for me and she ripened home ripened them for me i'm eating mangoes every day you know what is so special about our tree mango it is so so sweet even the raw mango you won't feel it sour it is so sweet it's a very special mango tree i'll show you guys see can you see the mangoes can you see the mangoes through these window bars because from downstairs i couldn't focus it that much we've got hundreds of mangoes hanging down there but we couldn't pick it if i could transport this tree with me to uk i will take it you know we've got lots and lots of space in our garden but i can't grow mangoes there in that weather see so many mangoes i've got so many in the kitchen also downstairs i'm upstairs now my bedroom is here see there lots and lots of mangoes are there i love mornings in chennai it's really nice look at that. can you hear the sound of the birds i just love that sound it is so nice it is so positive we are going for jewelry shopping today me and my mom are going my mother in law is not coming she is she is very tired she is not doing that great but first we are going to a temple vadapalli murugan temple and then we are going for gold jewel shopping i'll show you downstairs i'll show you all the trees that we have got i'll take you downstairs <laughs> I'm getting hiccups. You know, Pathi used to climb up this. There is a water tank there. He used to pick mangoes from there. But I am so scared to get up there. <laughs> We have lots of birds in this tree. It is Ashoka tree. Uh, let's go downstairs. You know, I got all this interest in gardening from my hubby, and he got it from his dad. <laughs> We have these coconut trees. We have. four of them look there are coconuts in it but we need people to bring it down we do it twice or thrice a year here we go we had loads of trees but um, my mother in can't take care of those she's old now after my after my father in law died we had to downsize all the trees and we have cut it down i'm getting a lot of hiccups water is coming from the tank and it is which it off let's go downstairs now i'll show you all the plants we have left this is the house we live here we live upstairs here there my mother in law is there and we have got a house downstairs also but um, the tenants are there now we have let it for rent we've got a sump there water comes into that sump there that's the sump and we used to have lots of ornamental plants all over here and we used to have a goa tree there the red goa tree when my father in law was alive you know after he died we had to remove lots of things because my mother in law couldn't uh, she is very old now and she is not that strong right now so we had to remove lot of things this is Sorry, I'm getting hiccups again and again. This is henna. See, it's a very, very red henna. I've done it many times. I put mehndi in my hands many times. You know, it has got this plant has got lots and lots of sweet memories. Me and my kids will have uh, mehndi in both the hands, and Pathi used to feed dinner and lunch to us because we all we can't use our hands. And uh, we have got a drumstick tree here. Yeah, it's been cut. so that it will grow properly again see this is drumstick tree it was big last time but they've cut it now goa tree again um we've got plants flowers and everything and aloe vera and curry leaves used to be really big here 
we had lots of curry leaves but only one remaining i've taken lots of curry leaves powder from here my mother in law used to make it for me and we had lot of coconut trees see uh, lots of we had chiku also that is also coconut tree that's chiku tree and the orange tree this is our mango tree we used to have lots of betel leaves the whole place was covered with betel leaf plant people used to take it you know the pan betel leaves those ones uh, but we removed it it was very tough to manage it so look at the mangoes there are lots and lots of mangoes fallen down see they fell on their own we have lots of mangoes like this we got water in our well now because it was raining for a couple of days in chennai so otherwise this dries up you know we used to have water all the time but these days it dries up this is our backyard and we used to have 3 4 4 5 uh, i think i remember yeah when i got married you know that time banana trees we used to have all banana trees now they're all gone and we are not here to maintain so my mother in law is not able to do that so this is fine yeah this is all we can do here look how i am sweating <laughs> i just took shower but i'm sweating a lot you know right after shower you sweat for an hour or something and then it settles down even my kurti is all wet <laughs> completely wet i'm going to the shops now first we are going to the temple and then we are going for gold shopping It's been a long time since I visited Padapalli Murugan Temple. During my school days, we used to go there at least twice or three times a month. I have so many lovely memories from those days. Some places we feel more connected and we have a good vibration than other places. This temple is like that for me. You get emotionally attached to the place, don't you? It gives you happiness instantly. This Vadapalli Murugan Temple is one place, and I also love Tirumalai Se Perumal Temple. I feel at peace when I go there. When I got my first job, we came to this temple to pray and get blessings. So many sweet memories. It's been a long time since I was here. We just finished darshan in the temple. It was so beautiful. I'm very happy. It was a lot of crowd as it is the weekend, but still we didn't have to wait for long time. The queue really moved very quick. Mom is buying some puja items here. My nephew wanted a rudraksham, so we are looking for that also. Um, there are a lot of stalls outside the temple. You can buy all the puja items that you need. Everything in one place. My sister has given a big list of items she needs. Uh, I've also bought a few kolam stickers. I want them for my puja room decoration. I'm going to take them to UK. We are headed to GRT Jewelry now. We have decided to go to the one in uh, Usman Road because they've got two stores in Tinagar area, uh, but the one in Usman Road is big jewel store. They will have more collections there, I suppose. We used to go to the old GRT store, but today we are going to the new one. We have reached GRT Jewelry. I love this ruby emerald layered necklace but it doesn't have the matching bangles and earrings we have to get them separately and match it so we are going to find the matching ones idea how's this one i'm checking this i like this design yeah. 
This set comes with the earring, but uh, have a look at this. It has got white. I wanted it to be with uh, red and green again, with the ruby and the emerald. So it'll match. This design is really good, but I need it in different colors so that it matches the harem. I searched in the other sections and I've brought these two from there, but this one matches, right? Uh, the green, red and white also. It has got all the three, but this one doesn't suit. That one does. That's the exact match for that. We are looking for the bangles. Uh, I needed the matching bangles for that. For that also, I want some ruby emerald combination, so it will set with that. You've got the earrings at least. We are looking for bangles. Look at this harem. I just saw it there. I really loved it. But this is a bigger one. Uh, it is made with rubies. So beautiful, isn't it? It has got antique finish, antique dollar in it. It's kind of ruby and antique. We just finished our gold shopping. We are so hungry. Someone in the shop suggested there is a Murugan Idli restaurant nearby and it's very good apparently. It's nearby the shop in the same North East Mount Road. My favorite Varaka Bhaji, it is the raw banana Bhaji. It's very busy at this restaurant. We had to wait for some time to get a table. The taste is really good. They keep bringing the samba, different varieties of chutneys and they keep, putting, they keep serving it. I'm eating dosa for my lunch. I don't know why I always eat dosa. <laughs> Because I love it. I'm still eating my budgie, but they've already brought it. Uh, it is very hot. And the table service here is very, very good. They're so nice people, so respectful and everything. I love it. It has started raining now. We had so much fun today. I hope you enjoyed this video with us. If you did, why not hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel to stay in touch with me. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.